Hello everyone, my name is Sagita Miriam Sunara. I'm an assistant professor at the Conservation Restoration Department of the Arts Academy in Split, Croatia. One of the courses I teach to first year students is preventive conservation. And uh, the topic of my video is related to this course. This was a two-part assignment. I assigned each student a text that is related to care and handling of um, certain objects or a certain type of material. And uh, I used the texts that are published on the Canadian Conservation Institute website, the National Park Service website, and uh, on the Smithsonian's Museum Conservation Institute website. I find these all very useful resources that I want my students to become familiar with and that I want my students to use, uh, use more frequently uh, in the future. Now, students were asked to illustrate the texts that they were assigned. So, in other words, they had to create um, illustrated the guidelines uh, for the care and handling of a certain type of object or material. And, um, they were then asked to scan these uh, illustrations and to import them into PowerPoint um, presentations. Then each student gave a short presentation um, in class on the assigned topic. Uh, the idea is that the best illustrations will be used to create posters which will be presented at the annual Conservation Restoration Students Conference. The next conference will take place in April next year and it will be hosted by my department. Now, after the conference, all the posters will be displayed at the conservation, the posters that my students created, will be displayed at the Conservation Restoration Department so that other students, so that especially the future uh, generations, um, can use them as a learning resource. The second part of the assignment also had to deal with the text that the students were assigned to read, and um, it consisted of creating a short um, video, and the idea was that these videos would or will later be posted on my department's uh, Facebook page. This is what the videos were supposed to look like. It was important for the students uh, to extract only the most important information from the text uh, they read. And then um, when they were preparing uh, the, these pieces of papers with the text, it was important that they pay close attention to how much text there is on each paper and how much time uh, a viewer would need to read this text. The great thing and about these videos is that you don't need any special technical skill or sophisticated equipment uh, to create these videos. You can use your smartphone, all of my students have, have smartphones, or you can use a or you can use a camera, which is what I'm using to create um, this video. And For students, uh, very interesting. Um, it really sparked their creativity, and um, it was for them fun to learn uh, about these issues related to preventive conservation. And very importantly, students were engaged in learning, and they were also uh, engaged in um, they, they were also engaged in transferring the knowledge they had acquired to their colleagues. Mm -hmm. Not only were these videos attract Facebook likes, but um, they will also uh, educate general public, so the people who follow our Facebook page, how to properly uh, take care of the objects they own um, or the objects that they come in contact with. 
I hope that you have found uh, this story interesting or inspiring. And um, I look forward to seeing you all uh, very soon. Bye-bye.